Well, it looks like uh, Ivory has uh, written another article. And since I liked his other article so much, I'm just going to go ahead and do what I did before and just uh, run commentary on this one. It's called Twitch Networking. What and how? Oh, and uh, there's going to be a slight amount of background noise. I have to have the fan on because it has to blow over my mouse. Otherwise, uh, my hands get real sweaty and sticky and it just makes a real mess. Hope it's not too bad. But like I would say, especially when I'm close to I'm I don't think you're probably bigger than I am, bud. I've been streaming for months and I only have six followers, so. Yeah, I have a huge community of awesome people to grab. Networking. The Twitch stream was connected with other like-minded streamers to do this by sharing communities for the most part, creating long-lasting friendships and bonds with other streamers. Um, I used to do this. There was a uh, back when I streamed Diablo three. I think there was a uh, two other people. We were and uh, all three of us were new streamers, but. <clears throat> Over time, we just kind of drifted apart. It is different interests. I mean, they're—I uh, think they're still doing a uh, PS4 games where I've—I've I've shifted over into streaming P or P PS3 PC games. So I just kind of dissipated. The guy is different than engaging random viewers and trying to grow in a general sense. Simply putting you on the, putting the other you know, streamers. Uh, yeah, it's. <clears throat> I try to, but more often than not, it doesn't work. Which I'm pretty sure he's gonna, he's gonna sort of kind of ask why as I go on down the line. Here's where you may be asking, well, what if my viewers stop coming on my stream and go to theirs? I'm not used to. Heck, um, <clears throat> one of the uh, one of the other guys I knew, he was actually hosting my channel, and for a very brief period, I was actually getting extra viewers, but it only lasted for a short period, and never saw him again. So it's definitely me, not him. Yep. And I agree. If you're ever on the Twitch forums for any length of time, you're gonna see a lot of people complaining about their uh, streams that aren't about their streams not growing. <clears throat> Everybody pretty much says the same thing. It takes time, but it's almost. It, I mean, the only reason I could probably think of for people not for people to not want anything to do with your stream. It's because they're stream snobs. That's the only reason, the only legit reason I could probably think of. They're they're so used to entertaining charismatic people, you know, on you know 1080p computers and then you know, great sound, great video, you know, lots of prizes. It's like going into a damn amusement park in their streams with all the uh, overlays and donations, and you can enter to win a drawing to get a new, get a brand new. 2160p computer or whatnot, you know, stuff like that. So they they see so much of that, and then they go into your own stream, and you're just, ew, this sucks, man. And then off they go. But to me, that's probably the only legit reason I can think of, other than, other than well, that's your fault. If they are going to other streams when you're. That's their choice, yep. Some of these factors include what are not limited to busy with work, busy with school, busy modding another stream, not even type my streams anymore, time zones. They don't find enjoyment out of your stream anymore. And um on the on a Ivory's previous article that I commented on, um I said that uh 
I have just as many reasons for leaving somebody else's stream as they have for leaving mine. So, I'm definitely no spring chicken when it comes to this. I mean, because I've got this whole laundry list of things that make me leave everyone else's streams too. So, I'm no different. None of these reasons are we for you to be upset. Yep. Quit. Yep. Um, I stream as much for me as much for anyone else, so if I did it solely for other people, I would have been disappointed and quit a long time ago. You cannot. And so far I hope this article gets a whole ton of likes because like I said, if you ever on the Twitch forums for any length of time, you're going to see a lot of people complaining that their streams aren't growing or that it's uh, it's just their fault and not their own. I see viewers disappear for a year and then come back. Yeah, that's, that's pretty much me right there. I mean, for a while, I was watching other people's streams religiously, but after a while, the frustration just builds up for some reason or another I end up having end up leaving theirs so okay I'll just I'll highlight number one I'll just highlight the titles host and raid someone um yeah I was pretty I was hosting just about any of my friend any of my friends uh Anybody that uh, talked to me and followed me, I'd host you. But thing of it is, is I'm such a small-time streamer that hosting is almost pointless because nobody ever calls on my stream. So, and then um, for some of those other people, or for the one and only person I can think of that actually was actually hosting mine, people that would come on my streams, you know, they didn't like it for some reason or another, and off they went. It almost seemed like I was making more enemies than friends. So. It was almost counterproductive. Uh, raiding? I'm not a raider. I'm mostly a... I'm, for the most part, a solo player. So, and I don't... I'm not a fan of uh, wiping wiping into the same thing over and over and over and over. Uh, some people have that drive and determination to wipe 100 plus times on one monster or on one boss, whereas I don't. Engage with streamers on other social media. Well, you know, that's that's another kind of problem because uh, the few people I know don't don't advertise on on social media, or if they, they probably do use it, but they might be like myself too. They were they're trying to keep up. Uh, they're trying to keep their stream life or their game life and their real life totally separate. So if you're talking. If you're talking like meeting them as real people, that's never going to happen. I mean, I keep my, I mean, I keep my personal life private too, away from my gaming life. So that's pretty much going to be a no go with me. Join Twitch streamer Facebook groups. Okay. Oh, excuse me, in forums, I know I'm on them a lot. I'm on the Twitch forums fairly often. Um, I'm on Final Fantasy forums fairly often. Uh, Facebook, I stay away from that. Like I said, I try to keep my uh, I try to keep my gaming and personal life separate. So, and all all of my personal stuff is on Facebook. So, I stay way the hell away from it. Um, let's see what else. Set aside time to stream hop. Don't. I don't really have one. Mostly because uh, more often than not, all I'm doing is clicking, clicking everyone else's streams, and then getting off them just as fast because because they turn me off for some reason or another. Oh. Uh -oh. 
actually going around to visit some streams. I used to do this, but like I said, it it got too frustrating. So it's all but rare now. Generally, if you follow me, I'll check you out. That's pretty much the only way I do it these days. Because uh, if you're interested in my stream, you're one of the rare ones, so you you're definitely got to be worth a watch. Twitch family, I can see that happening. It also gives you even bigger streamers. I tend to stay away from the bigger streamers. I matter less to them. I mean, they already have they already have so many followers that I ain't gonna mean diddly squat. I mean, there's not much I'm gonna be able to contribute that the other. 99,999 followers they have could have already contributed anyway. That's a waste of effort. I have a few large streams that have. And I've been rated. And have been rated by. Uh, I wonder if. Uh, I wonder if rating has a different meaning. Or if he has a different meaning for raid. We might, we might be thinking two different things. I'm thinking raiding as in you know, getting a group of guys together and trying to fight the big boss that takes forever and a day to kill. That kind of thing. Okay, okay, yeah. So he... So we have the same... We have the same definition then. not to do I did this one time and I'm not a fan of it I mean I followed him he followed me but he just kind of disappeared he just kind of disappeared in the nether after that and seen him since don't plug your link into appropriate places no, nope I don't do that either. Um, I only plug my link into Twitter, um, Final Fantasy blog on the Lodestone, uh, on Google Plus, but I don't. I don't try to toot my horn where I wouldn't think it'd be wanted. <laughs> it's pretty self-explanatory, yeah. But not everybody gets the message. I mean. I'll post a pinball arcade on YouTube, and I'll get um, I'll get slut girls wanting me to subscribe to them. Like, I mean, hell, man, if I want, <clears throat> hell, man, if I want to do that, I'd probably go on Pornhub or type down Pamela Anderson on Google or something like that. Man, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be looking on YouTube. I sure was posting. Yeah, it's. Very disrespectful. Let's say you're going to do something and not follow through. Um, couldn't give you exact dates or moments, but I'm pretty sure I probably made this mistake at least once. Like, yeah, I'm going to stream tonight, and then all of a sudden, I'll have to post on a Twitch channel feed. It's all right, couldn't make it. My back's, I slept wrong, and my back's extremely hurting, you know, or something like that. But, yep. Which might also be one of the reasons why my uh, stream, why nobody visits. Yeah, basically keep your word. But like I said, to be fair, I probably met, I probably done this at least once. Usually, shit happens for some reason, and couldn't make it. make a fool of yourself in someone else's community yep this is also one of the reasons why I'm very reluctant to visit other people's streams I got this habit of saying the wrong thing you know I'm I'm on a dip I'm in a different train of thought than most other people 
and then I, I've had, I've had stream. I'll ask a streamer a question, and they'd be like, "Well, yeah, I, I guess you can do that." Um, oh, okay. Uh, well, no one's ever asked me that before, and like I almost embarrassed her in front of all of her fans. So, I just, so been there. Yup. Hosting, rating, someone saying I vouch for this person. I, yup. That's it. Was all. It also goes back to what I was saying earlier. Um, if you're following me, I'll go ahead and check you out. Because if you're, I'm one of those that are. I have next to no followers or next to no viewers at all. So if you're actually are willing to. Follow me for whatever reason. You you definitely got to be worth you definitely got to be worth checking out. So it's kind of kind of along this here too. If you're vouching for me, you probably have a really good reason. If you host someone who is an asshole, your viewers are going to stop. Yup, yup. Looks like that's the end of the article. All right, well. Well, as it's getting close to one o'clock p.m. here, and I still have to, I still have to shower and shave, and I'm gonna have to lay down and have to work tonight. I, I was just browsing the internet. I took a two hour nap, so I'm actually gonna be up a little later than normal. But uh, that's, that's it. And I'm out of here. And until next time, take care.